In this video, we're going to focus on another crucial step in the brewing process, port boiling. Sweet wort collection in the kettle actually starts during the process of wort separation. Generally speaking, it takes about 60 minutes to fill a brew kettle during wort runoff. Heating is applied right away so that the temperature of the wort reaches boiling by the time the brew kettle is full. By the end of runoff, the kettle should be full and the wort should start to boil. At that point, the first kettle wort sample is collected for specific gravity measurement. First hops are usually added to brew kettle at the start of the boiling process. These bittering hops are added to balance the sweetness of wort. The boiling process should be vigorous and intensive and should last anywhere between 60 and 120 minutes. Aroma hops are added to the kettle typically between 5 and 10 minutes before the end of the boil. Major wort boiling objectives are summarized below. At the very end of the wort boiling process, the kettle knockout wort sample is collected for a specific gravity measurement. Typical evaporation rates during wort boiling are anywhere between 5 and 10 percent. Wort is finally being pumped from the kettle to the whirlpool for the removal of coagulated protein and hop material. 